I am here as one of the cultural leaders who have been invited by the World Economic Forum uh, to really um, explore how we can impact on the forum in total. So I will be uh, speaking on uh, how to make education inclusive and how to make employment inclusive uh, of people with different kinds of abilities and disabilities. I'm at Davos. Um, the conference is great, but what's really great is it's created a center of gravity that has attracted lots and lots of interesting people. And so even outside the conference, you have meetings and discussions and dinners with people who have come, come from all over the world and are willing to get in a contemplative talking mood. And that's very helpful for people like me. Um, I'm here because I've been invited. Um, I didn't ask for, but I was convinced that I should be here to contribute on two panels um, on the future of Europe. And um, it's my first time here, and I'm just trying to cope with my feelings. <laughs> We're incredibly happy and privileged to be here at the World Economic Forum uh, to share with everyone the Access Plus Ability exhibition. This exhibition shares the value and importance of inclusive design and is really encouraging people to think about how we can create a more inclusive world. Microsoft has been attending Davos for a long time. We come here as a company to conduct business, to participate in the conversations uh, at a global level with leaders from around the world. And in our space here in the cafe, we invite people in uh, just to come and spend time with Microsoft to learn a little bit more about us, but also to get some warmth, to get some Wi-Fi and to get some coffee.